flash. The old proverb says, there's no smoke without fire, and there's no mention of any old flame. Okay, Tuts. In the good old pre-talky days, the producer couldn't get on without a lot of smoke. Ah, oh, break it up. And going back a bit more, some of the old priests used a sort of smoke screen to get their best effects. This performance was always a great success. Yes, it was all done with a little smoke, a lot of palaver, and a concave mirror of burnished metal. The son then took a hand with a daughter. Another mirror at floor level projected the image onto the smoke on the other side of the screen. What is smoke? We'll analyze a candle flame and you'll notice that only the outer part is flame. The dark center is unburnt. But if we put a tube into the unburnt part, the vapor can be drawn off and lit. Smoke is actually wasted fuel, as this experiment shows. See how the gas bursts into flame before the wick is touched? If we propel smoke through a hole, the results are beautiful ring. But beware you bachelors, these are the sort of dreamy rings that often lead to the more substantial kind. By immersing chemical dry ice in neat, wet water, we can produce dense white smoke. And this sort of smoke isn't wasted. It can be used to show the effect of air currents on airfoil, a plane's lifting surface. The smoke is suction pumped through holes in the smoke box, and the airfoil is good if the airflow is smooth. This is excellent streamlining. But this disturbance, these eddies at the back are bad. So to a festival of smoke, the trails that are blazed by the knights of the air, to them, are homage. Thank you.